So, good morning. Uh, I'm planning to go today to Haifa and to Acre. Acre is a fortified city and Haifa has some beautiful gardens. So those are the highlights and the interesting points to, to go there. So we passed security and now I have to find the ticket. It seems that the back and forth ticket is cheaper, so I will try to get one of those. Clearly here is key to ask people where to go. It's impossible to understand something. The, everything is in Hebrew and signs everything. So you don't understand anything. They, they, they don't make announcements in English either. So our train was 9.15, I think we missed it. So the next one is 9.26. This is definitely not the best meal. It's uh, really, really dry. So one tip, use those numbers to navigate the trains. That makes it a lot easier than reading this. The weather is actually really nice today. It doesn't feel humid. It's a bit hot, but there's also a breeze, so it's it's okay. It's not as hot as it used to be. I think this must be the best day so far. It smells really bad here. I'm never going to understand why cities don't take care of uh, tourists. This is a really touristic area where it's just going to the fortress. So probably a lot of tourists walk by and they have that uh, pile of trash that smells a lot. That gives a really bad image to the city. I think we are almost there. This must be the entrance. The moat, land gate, hotels, horses beach. I wonder what that is. Right away.
just a word of advice, if you're at Accor, you can come eat to this place. The food is really good. You can see it by the queue. This city is really nice. I like the architecture and the colors of the walls. Although it's purely touristic. So reading at this, it seems that it was a, a secret tunnel and it was discovered in 1994, not too long ago. So yeah, maybe instead of calling it the Templar Tunnel, it should be called the Secret Templar Tunnel. I think that the title sells a bit more. I'm not the tallest guy and I have to almost crawl here. So I would be, I'm really sorry for anyone that's 180 or 2 meters tall. Here I can walk standing. I must admit that the only reason why I know who the Templars are is because of Assassin's Creed. This is really cool. I strongly recommend the visit to this place. It is getting a bit humid. The lack of air produces more humidity since there's no air to, to dry. And we went from coast to coast. And it was a good way to touch the heat and the sun. Remember when I said that it was not going to be that hot today? Well, I was wrong. Look at that guy fishing there. How did he get there? There's no path. Ah. How did he do it? Although it doesn't look to be that deep, maybe he walked his way there. I feel like I'm walking in Europe, just the Middle East version of it. Europe is just too broad. Maybe I just I should say like I'm walking. I feel like I'm walking in Italy and. This is just the Middle East version of it. I want this video to be a proof that visiting Accor is totally worth it. It's truly a beautiful city and it's really well preserved. Despite my initial comments, I think the, they put a lot of money on preserving the city and keeping it beautiful for tourists maybe the cleaning could be a bit better i've, I've seen a lot of trash everywhere well we were looking for the night hall but there's an event so we can't get in So now we are going to take the bus to Haifa. It's really hot, so we don't want to walk all the way to the train station again. And since we have a, a day ticket that covers trains, tram, buses, like rail, everything, the whole day, then we will just take the bus. So basically we loaded that contract to the to the transport car they are called contracts so for example if you get a single ride that's also called a contract then you just renovate them or cancel them 
Hello. Bye, thank you. So now we have to wait 20 minutes. So it's close. We came here for nothing. It seems that it opens from 6 to 9. Uh, at the top there's only another viewpoint. So we'll have to wait or leave and go back to Tel Aviv. So now I went to the bus 136. I decided to stay because uh, the garden, the middle section of the garden opens only twice a year during the religious celebration. So it's a good chance. Uh, so if I miss it, I might not ever see it. Actually, the, the parts that open are the top one and the lower one. Check this out. Early today, we were there in that far, far away point, which is the city of Akko. So I made a mistake and I was at the top point. I should have been at the middle point. So now I'm walking there. It will take me about 20 minutes to reach the, the temple. I will put the map here so you can see where you should be. And there's a queue to enter. So 30 minutes to get in.